Well, today's little escapade, with permission from the Corlett family, is to Glenroy, Myrington Glenroy Reservoir. Come down the top way from some old ruins. It is private, folks, so no trespassing. If we give permission. I've just been talking to the farmer this morning. He was telling us about their summer fun they have on this particular little stretch of water. Don't know if you can see it or not, but they have their uh, boards. It's like a slip and slide. So you go down here, you start your run from here. Hang on, point out. Here. You need to come round. Take a run on your board, I'm guessing head first. Slip and slide. No otherwise, would there? All the way down. Probably soapy. Soapy tarpaulin. board, yeah, yeah. And then whoosh, straight into the water. Belly flop. And then there's a ladder on the side to get out. It's handy, it's nice. Yeah. <laughs> you not, go first. Not really sure when the dam was established. Um, although the farmer said it was tied to the Glenroy Mines and there's a channel which takes the water from here a mile downstream to power the wheels. So, can only guess it must have been established at the same time. <clears throat> they did want to extend it, didn't they? So it would uh, provide water for Garwick. They did. And uh, where was the other place? Um, just round here, Haxenfell, Laxey. Yeah. It's amazing how many yeah res reservoirs there are actually, because um, you've got your Agnish one as well. Yeah. I don't yeah. think that's providing for anywhere as well. No, no. he says that this, this water only doesn't go, doesn't do anything except feed their own stock these days. Hmm. Not sure how big it is. Difficult to estimate, really. They used to say in the old days that. Uh, a family needed 100 gallons of water a day. And that's how they estimate the size of the reservoir. This is the ladder the lads would have uh, walked out to, off the reservoir after their slide down the hill. All organised. We've got the customary buddies with us today. <coughs> Dogs are with us. No. Oh, I can't even see it. The farmer said below here was like a stopcock. Oh, I can just see the pipe there. And uh, a valve to let the water out when they want to clear it. And then we go down back into the river. Oh, quite dizzy up here, my love. You what? Got, 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 I got quite dizzy there. I was just waiting for you to fall in. You are such a cow. <laughs> Look at this cute bridge here. Look at that little bridge. Isn't that fabulous? Lovely. Ha. Little four stone bridge. That have been here nearly 150 years, I reckon. And this would have been, uh, I'm guessing, what he called the channel water. That's what I was just thinking. Going somewhere, isn't it? Yeah, so I'll have a look so I can find a trough down there. Oh, it's cold. Different to believe that this uh, reservoir is a mile from the uh, mines. And uh, the channel must have gone that distance. The other side of the channel, and uh, we're standing on a little, another little bridge. It 
must have just followed the river down, but it would have been guided off somewhere to stick with the top yeah. bit. He said we would have seen it, but it just oh, all seems to be going down. And that there is the uh, other side of the uh, valve that lets the water out. That's the other side of the uh, valve. You can just see the uh, pipe exiting just in the archway. Is that it there? <laughs> doesn't make any sense because look there's that little thing there but it would be getting pushed all the way up there so you'd need some other force of something wouldn't you mm. so we're going to try and see if we can locate this magic channel oh. somewhere oh I'm lace these always come undone I thought you were walking a bit slow this morning you've had them tied together haven't you yes dear I dare say it could have been a channel car and maybe it's uh, filled in a lot. Yeah, the little cogs are going round in my head trying to figure the whole thing out. Really. I can hear them from here. <laughs> Oh, drop one. Oh, you have. <laughs> the smell was. <laughs> We're on the way to the mines now. Haven't found the reservoir. Apparently, there used to, there used to be a duck shoot there, but I just see ducks today. Apparently, good for cleaning weed out of the water. I'll put these before we do the mines. Uh, no, I, I said that we'll have them when we go to the, the first wheel casing. Yeah? Yes, darling. Anything you say, my sweet. So we've left the farmer's track and we're now travelling down to what could be a chasm he was talking about or the channel. I wonder if that other little run down there was it, because we're way too high now, aren't we? It's not this one anyway. No. So you stay there. God. What will you see? Where have you been? Trying to read stuff and you keep wandering off. God, I missed you. Ah, James Richards was the captain. Right. Um, and then his son, William Henry, would work there too. Family business then? Uh, it, I think 1874, it was owned by Laxey Mining Company. Yeah, it became part of the group, didn't it? And then, because it, it wasn't really 
producing much. Glenroy Mining Company took over. But it wasn't open very long, really. So we're just coming down to some of the buildings. We'll get a bit closer while we poke around in a little chat about them. Oh, look at the big cow over there. Mm. I'm glad it's all the way over there. It's a lot of bullocks, that love. Hey? A lot of bullocks. Is that a bull? Yeah. <sighs> now then, is that the run? So I reckon that this would be the channel. Ah, yes. Brilliant, so let's follow that then. I wonder where it started down there then. The water would have come along a channel from the reservoir. It's difficult to believe the reservoir is actually that much higher than here. Ha, oh, fantastic. Just running under where the gorse is. Roxy, come out of there. Roxy! Put that in there. So she ran all the way along there, under the gorse. Man-made channel, dug out by hand, no JCBs in 1860. Must have took forever to, you know, build all these things, because they didn't have the machinery, did they? No. God. Ah, so there you go. So it would have gone along and then that way. So. Pretty cool. But you don't fall down a hole. If you can actually make out the um, stanchions or pillars, the water would have come out of that channel, ran right angles down over here. Wood, I imagine. I'd have said left angle. Oh. Right <laughs> angle is just how they call it, the right angle, whatever it is. Down to the, to the wheel casement. And then the water would run down over the wheel, driving it or powering it. And we think it would then exit out somewhere and go down to the other casement, which... We, we haven't figured out the system yet. We haven't figured the system. But we've got this system sorted here, that's for sure. Yes, the rest might all fall into place, <laughs> like a bad nightmare. <sighs> Plump, Danny. I think I'm sitting at my food. Is this where we're sitting? Yeah, I'm gonna sit on the ferns. Okay. Yeah, look, see the runoff there. Ah, oh, wow. Amazing. So the channel would have diverged here, there would have been a sluice gate here, I reckon to actually switch off the water when they didn't want the wheel turning. And then the water would have travelled down there over this here stone pillar and out over there. I reckon there's another end, look, so it keeps going and look at that fenced off bit there. No? Mm, could do. They have it from both ends. Could be running water off that hill or something, couldn't it? It'd be swimming back out into the stream, wouldn't it? I'd have to have seen a picture of it in the day. Picture of you which cost hundreds of pounds those days to do a photograph. Yeah. That's a mighty moment. So Carla's now gonna pretend to be a, a gush of water. 
and she's walking along the channel the water would have come down here along these stones would have been a wooden chute and it Whee! would have gone down along on top of that there all those pillars as I said and it wouldn't shoot down into the wheel casing we'll go down and have a look at the wheel casing I think how would you take pictures on your phone? Oh God, just like yours, love. Oh, this bottom. So I've already done everything for you. Cheeky bitch. <laughs> That's not nice. Ah! Where's Roxy? Come here, Roxy. Here. Come here, Roxy. Are you going to turn around and face the camera, or are you going to have your backside? No, I'm just going to. I'm just visioning, looking out to the view. You know. That's it. Have you done it? Yep. So we're going to go down to the wheel casing and see. Uh, That's a good picture that you did do a video. You must have swiped it or something. Well, it did I do a photo as well. You did two little videos. You must have just moved it with your hand. Do you want to take it again? No, it's OK. I can pause it. It's a good job one of us is clever. <laughs> He's a lucky man. You are a lucky man, aren't you? Yeah. Hey, look, so there would have been little wooden ridges going in there, see? Wooden thingies. I mean, halfway up the pillar. Yeah. Mm -hmm. so it would have had some sort of frame, which is well gone now, obviously. So maybe the actual uh, thing didn't run along the top of the pillars then? Do you know what? You wouldn't know, would you? Because there's no pickies of it. No, there's no pickies. <laughs> I can't see anything with these glasses on. Bloody rubbish. So. That's a very thin wheel, isn't it? I don't think that'll be the wheel casing, will it? Well, it's got, if you look around here, it's got a thingy in here. In the wall there. Well, now is a little bit of consternation from us. This is not a very wide... Actually, no, the next slot over, is it that one? There's another slot there. I'm going to have to go down below and do it. Yeah. No. Well, it's definitely a wheel casing because there's a runoff there, see the yeah. hole under there. Maybe there was two wheels here, there, and the one at the bottom. Maybe. Because all that water from the reservoir would need to be controlled, I suppose. Because look, there is still another viaduct there that would be... Yeah. Maybe it was just parting both of them, I don't know. Ooh. I'm have to go down. We're going to have to go down. Lock it down, folks. So this was one of the little offices, I'm guessing. Looks like it had a fireplace down there, windows. Upstairs and a downstairs. This would be the hub of the uh, workers for the wheel, I'm guessing, or the office. It's where they brought the body once they'd hauled him back up again. Really? Yeah. Well, they, they said it in next to one of the wheels is what they said. So it's either this or that place over there. Very strange. Let you out, let you out there. Uh, hey? It lets your imagination run wild, really, doesn't it? Yeah, see, look at the hole in the wall there. I'm going to see if there's any machinery anywhere. Oh, I'm cold. Might look sunny, but it ain't. Oh, ha! Nearly cracked my head then. Oh, Bloody hell. Careful. Oh, look, there's some metal. Metal. 
Hmm. Some metal, girl. Metal? I reckon this is like an engine room or something. Because all this is metal. Isn't it? Yep. So I wonder what this would be. This would be part, must be some workings for it, wouldn't it? That's what I'm thinking. Watch it's a very low start. bloody thing, isn't it? It's only made for people like you. Well, you knew about when you apply for mining jobs, the first question was on the form, do you know what it was? What? What height are you? <laughs> Anybody under five foot got a job straight away, apparently. <laughs> yeah, these are just the workings. This ain't the office, is it? No way. It looks like there's a hole there as well, so watch for your foot. And... As much as that looks like a fireplace, I don't really think it is. Yeah, it's a fireplace. There's chimneys up there, look. Is it? Yeah. Well, why is there a bloody hole towards the outside there? It's just been knocked out and over the years. It's definitely, that's definitely a... It's difficult to believe that there'd be a wheel in here, wouldn't you think? Yeah, because that's not going to turn anything. Up there is about the right height. But there's nothing on the other side. I don't bloody know. Do we stand like that? Only when I need a wee. I don't think this is the, this is the wheel arch. No, it's not looking uh, very wheely, is it? No. Whoop. I'll tell you what I know. I know what this is now. What is it? Ah! What happened? What? Oh, just some briar things started brushing my hair for me. Oh, dear. Oh. That's the bloody wheel casing. That's what I was going to tell you. Yeah. Don't you be telling me anything. Wow. Now that's more like it. So why did they have a bloody gap there? I'll tell you. So after a lot of uh, consternation <laughs> and cussing and swearing, we both reckon this would have been the wheel casing. Yeah, that's definitely wide enough, isn't it? Yeah, now the centre channel there, in my opinion, was where the excess water ran off. And that water would have then ran down here to the other one. That's what I reckon. All right. Oh, there's absolutely nothing to show that goes onto that wheel, is no. there? Nothing at all. Shall I go in? Yeah, go in and fall. I just walk up normally. Well, this. Go on, you're doing this for prosperity. Shut up. Careful. There won't be a hole anywhere, will there? I would have thought so. Why is that there like that? Actually, Roxy, come on. Come on. Go get it. Bit creepy. Some height, isn't it? Yeah. Wow. Yeah, it's got all the, the stuff. It's definitely here. Right, well, we sort that out. Good. <laughs> I'm going to have to hold the camera some days, you know. You can go and risk your life. <laughs> I wonder what all this bit's about then. I don't know. I'm going to walk along and just... I love the... Uh, see the colour in the yeah. stones. It's fabulous, isn't it? <coughs> Obviously never gets any sun. I wonder what those little holes are for then. 
Hey. I wonder what these little holes are for. I don't know. Definitely letting water out somewhere, isn't it? Yeah, I, I reckon so. Or would something be built up here as well? I reckon it's the other part of um, the workings. Because in them holes you'd have wood, wouldn't you? Yeah, I guess we'll see up there above us. Yeah. See where there must have been a big lump of wood. Yep. So that would have carried something, wouldn't it? Well, that's your, your wheel bit, isn't it? That they'd be turning your wheel and your, your workings would be on this side as well, wouldn't it? I would think so. Yeah. I just wanted to see if there's anything that would be like connecting to this, but maybe it would have all just been wood. I don't know. That'd be some, tr some job, wouldn't it? That is amazing, though, that. Wow. Yeah, they're just two separate buildings. So I've gone along now to a little building which would be part of Maybe somewhere where people stayed, or the manager's office, we're guessing. This is the captain's office. This is the captain's office. What was his name again? Oh. I'll just have a look. Captain Richards, I think. Was it? That's what you said, anyway. And the son worked here with him as well. Another one had another floor. I reckon this would have been the captain's house or office because it's all been rendered. Yeah. And he's got a little brick fireplace. James Richards. That's what I said. <sighs> Just a little brick fireplace. Ornately built. You gotta lose it, sister. Oh, lovely. Let's see. Uh, oh, yeah. So obviously it was just a posh office because none of the other places are rendered. <laughs> That's the old door there. Yeah, I saw that. Wow. He liked his heat to the old captain because he got fireplace each end. It's been roasting. Yeah. <clears throat> Maybe his little lavvy, privy. It's difficult to know. There's a little fireplace in there too. Really? Yeah. I wonder Could if that would be the... Cupboards, um, cupboards on the wall where the cupboards have been, where the wood is. See it? Yeah, I wonder if that would be the miners, <laughs> the little staff room. You and then the captain, there. that's that big massive house. You know your place, lads. Found the toilet. That looks more like the toilet, doesn't it? Yeah. Well, there's no door at the back to empty it. Surprisingly. Mm. And maybe let's see along here. This one here may have been the powder house. No, because it hasn't got a double thingy, has it? No. It's not far away enough. I don't think they used to do blasting here anyway. Didn't they? No, they were just picking. Can you maybe, yeah, you're probably right, actually. Well, that's the extent of the buildings anyway, Carla.
Hey, do you want to have a look at these original steps here? I do indeed. You're walking down them? Yes, I am, my love. I'm just thinking. It always excites me when I see something like this. Just the steps cars are walking on. I'm just thinking. By those 12 miners. 17 years backwards and forwards to the mines. Unbelievable. Why would they waste the time on steps? This wouldn't be a run for the water, would it? Well, it could be. They wouldn't run it down there though, would they? And then the wheel pump it out from there, outwards, no? Because they, they wouldn't go down there. That's where they had the ladders, wasn't it? Ah, I don't know, I'm so confused. That's not, doesn't, doesn't tie up with the... Manipulate it to go in the direction they want it to go in, can't they? You can steer it and direct it, I guess, shall we? I wouldn't go too close to the edge, my love. Yeah, I'm not. It's a nicer colour. Wow. That's amazing. <laughs> Find a little stick and throw it in or a stone, my love. See oh, yeah, the d bloody dickheads will jump in. Stone, then. I want to hear that splash. Okay. I want to say it, but I can't find a stone. I'll get it. Get hell. Ever prepared to oblige us, my darling? Now, don't forget this time, just let the stone go. What do you mean, let it go? What, not go with it? <laughs> Ready? I'll go get it. Do it again. Here, boy. No. Now, see down there? Yeah. Right in that corner there, there's a plaque on the stone. Do you see it? Right ahead of us? Yeah. See a square there? <sighs> yeah. This could have been the mine that poor old Mr. Gellingham was at the bottom of. Okay. Hmm. Would have looked a bit more neater than this, wouldn't it? There well, is the wall area around the it walls here. walls around it, isn't it? But there was another issue with this mine. It did keep collapsing in. Well, this is obviously still collapsing in. Yeah, it? so, you know, standing here is probably not the best idea. But, yeah, this this would be where they went down with their ladders. I just can't figure out that run of water. Maybe well, it just went straight down into the next wheel, I don't know. Let's go look at the next. There's another wheel casement here. There's some wooden stumps here, and that goes in line. So maybe it just ran straight down this way. I well, suppose you've got to think the conjecture of where the water came from to drive this next wheel. And um, if we think about it, they dug a channel a mile to get the water there, yeah. it wouldn't be difficult to do something to uh, come down from there, would it? Mm. It's all downhill still. And those posts there, they could be old tree stumps, but I think you're right. I think they're poles, hold something. Surely the wheel is to pump water out of something, isn't it? No? Yeah, no? Yeah, 
Oh, Jane, what are you proposing? Well, the wheel should have been pumping water out of that pit that's behind us. Mm -hmm. So that's what this one would have been for, just to pump the water out of that. But I don't understand why they had that running from the top to go down to here, to there. <laughs> well, they'd have to use some water to power this, wouldn't it, from somewhere? Very, very confused. Well, there'll be some experts out there who'll tell us what, what fools you are. Yeah, no doubt. I have tried to research about it, but I just can't get anything apart from what I've got. And I've tried to look at how water wheels work and things, but it's just not making sense here to me. Well, we're coming to the end of our... Um then really mind videoing and as always with us we've got far more questions than answers we've had to guess and I doubt people say that's rubbish you know what you're talking about why did you do it I'm glad we did that glad we did thinking this is going to be another wheel casing. So much work went into building these places. we have acquired the stone from here. That there looks like the rubbish they would have got out of the mines. What are called? Carl called Kibble. Gonna walk in there, my girl. Yeah. Like that stupid Roxy in. Ugh. Have you walked in here? Not this time, no, I did. I came down to the pictures. Like a wheel case. See, I don't see anything in here that would no. have been. It's no axle, is there? No. So I don't think there would have been two. It's not at the right height, unless it was further dug down. Like the spoils there, isn't it? Outside. Mm. I did think was this the entrance to the, the mine? That they go through here towards the mine, because if it was on levels. Come out here with the barrels to empty the rubble. Ribble? What do they call it? Kibble. kibble. Rubble, ribble, and kibble. Mm -hmm. That's yeah, our three dogs. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so I reckon because they just fill this in, wouldn't they? Because there's nosy buggers out there, aren't there? Yep. So as Carla said, we mm. that would think that mm. would be classed as kibble, the waste product from the sink and oil mining. And there would have been machinery to do some, because they would add something to break up the rocks, wouldn't they? They are, because look, there's something else there that's fell down. See? Yeah. I actually just think it's the entrance, really. Well, maybe. I don't know. I'd really love more information. Hmm. I no doubt someone's going to jump on this and tell me all about it. We having another uh, drinking chocolate session? Yeah, if you want. There's nothing down here that could be an entrance now. He did say he went down in ladders, but there was a slope to go in first. Well, after the mining, we decided to go down to Lannan Church. Feet. And um, see what we can see. And, uh, nice to see the flowers out and the sun is shining. Such a difference. I think the church is locked these days.
Where are I mission? To finish the video off. And there she says, All Saints Parish Church Line. Have an idea of which direction I'm going. So apologies to those who don't like people walking through graveyards, but today. Hmm, it's not on this bit. I think it's in the next row. We'll have to go round. We're looking for Mr Gelling's grave, hopefully to find it. We did find some Gellings here the other day, but they're not the right ones. Yeah, we thought it was that one there, but I don't think it is. That's the one I thought it was. Right, it's... I will find it. I think by Carla's reaction, she's actually located the actual gravestone. So I'll see if we can... Where are you, my love? I'm here. Should have brought us something to give it a, a little clean. Uh, let me see. Of Glenroy. November 15th, 1880. I can't quite read the rest of it. This must be the family underneath, is it? Yeah, so there's loving wife. So he was married, was he? So he did have a wife. Ah, let's see. Looks like her name was Eleanor, does it? Oh, loving memory. Oh. She died in 1920. There's, well, there's Jemima in 1936, 1920. John James Lewis or something of somewhere Laxey. Definitely go to the top there, Thomas Gelling. What's the stage just under that? Of Glenroy in in the uh, parish of Lonanya, who died November fifteenth, eighteen eighty, aged. 27 years. Is that what it says? Yeah. yeah, 27 years. Well done. Gosh. <laughs> also. In loving memory of. Of John James Lenny. Well, I guess Lewin. Oh, Lewin. Are you sure, Ellie? Oh, it is Lewin. Uh, of. Somewhere Laxey. Yeah, something of Laxey. Parish of Laxey. 69. Wonder I wonder who, who that was then. The relation he was to him. Jemima, hmm. widow off the above. Oh, so that might have been their son. Well, then again, it's got a different surname. Or yeah. would, would, would Lewin be a, a, a full name? No. No, I don't think so. It's a surname. Well, that's good, my love. Yeah, we Finishes found the him. video off, doesn't it? It does. What does it say around the top of it up there? Oh, hang on. Are you still recording? No. Oh. Going to. Right. So I need to do this one. 